trick to learn epigynous type of flowers examples aaj kumkum guava khayegi sun rays mein aaj apple kumkum coriander cucumber guava sun rays sunflower so coriander cucumber apple guava sunflower they have epigynous type of flower in which there is inferior ovary is present next topic that is estivation what is estivation arrangement of sepals and petals in a bud condition or arrangement of sepals and petals within flower is called estivation estivation is of following types first type is velvet estivation before that see here this symbol is indicating sepals and this concave shape symbol it is showing petal or corolla we are going to use these two symbols in floral diagram later on we will discuss about floral formula floral diagrams for different flower families so velvet in velvet estivation these are the sepals and this picture is showing the arrangement of sepals sepals they are touching each other but without any overlapping okay so no overlapping between the sepals so when sepals are arranged in such manner that type of estivation is called velvet estivation example of velvet estivation are brassica calotropis second type of estivation is twisted estivation here sepals they are arranged in such manner in orderly manner that their one margin is free but another margin that is overlapped by next sepal so overlapping is happening in all sepals but in orderly manner one side up one side down one side free one side overlapped by another sepal examples are china rose okra that is bhindi okay next uh, means lady's finger okra is the name we are using for that okay third type is imbricate estivation imbricate estivation is of two types ascending imbricate estivation descending imbricate estivation another name for descending is vexillary estivation in ascending if you see the arrangement of the sepals what type of arrangement they have one sepal is entirely overlapped by the two means it is completely inner side and one is completely outside three are one end inside one end outside so if we found such type of arrangement if we find such type of arrangement in flower that flower has ascending imbricate estivation example is gulmohar b descending imbricate estivation vexillary easily you can find this type of vexillary estivation in pea plant in pea flower in pea flower one petal is very big in size which overlap the next two wings they are called and innermost two together they are known as keel if we find such type of arrangement in a flower that is called vexillary estivation examples are pea plant as i already discussed then queen queen chill estivation it is uh, rarely it is found it is present in ranunculus two in two sepals or petals two in two completely out one in means one end in one end out so two in two out one in out it is for extra information otherwise it is not included in your slippers so how many types of estivation we studied velvet in which all the sepals or petals they are arranged in orderly manner no overlapping is there in case of twisted estivation that is the second type sepals or petals they are present in orderly manner 
there is overlapping what in orderly manner one end free one end overlapped by another sepal or petal third type is imbricate which is of two types ascending descending in ascending we find that one completely in one completely out and three are with one end in one end out and in descending which is also called vexillary it is present in pea flower one petal is very big in size which overlap the next two and those next two overlap the innermost one together that is called keel